The members of my team have been busily working for a while and have logged their time against JIRA issues using Tempo timesheets. At any point, I can get a quick overview of the hours that are logged by my team members. In this video, I'll show you how to view a timesheet for your whole team and even log time for your team members. I'm a team lead of my team here called CAFE. And the first thing I need to do is to check that I have permissions to view work done by my team members. So I go to permissions up here. I need the view team work logs permission, which is on by default for me as a team lead. So I'm good to go. And I also have given this permission to Saul, my team lead backup. Now I can go to timesheet up here to view my team's timesheet. At a glance, I can see the number of hours that each team member has been working. The first thing I should do is choose a time period using the calendar up here. And I want to see what my team did last week. Then I can group the data in different ways using filters in this field, such as by adding issue, so I can see the specific JIRA issues that each member is working on. Then from this menu on the right, I can select options for displaying more data. Logged is on by default, but I can add percentage of required hours that are logged, required hours, billable hours, or planned hours. I can view the data as a list for more of a report. And there are a few options that I can see only in the list view, such as account. But I'll go back to the grid view. When I'm done, I could also choose to export the timesheet in different formats, depending on what I want. But if I want to save this timesheet as a report and use other filters and options, I can use Tempo Reports to do this, which is covered in another video. From the team timesheet, I can even log time for my team members. They usually log their own time, but if one of them gets sick or they're on vacation when their timesheet is due, I can do it for them. To do this, I first need to have the Log Work for Others permission, which is a project one, and my JIRA administrator needs to set this for me. Now I'll go down to Sol and drag across these two days, and the Log Time dialog opens. I'll select the JIRA issue and enter the number of hours that he worked per day and click Log Time. And a work log is created for him here. Like many organizations, mine has implemented an approval process. This means that my team members must submit their timesheets to me for review and approval at the end of our company's reporting period. If this sounds like your company, check out the next video to see how to approve timesheets for your team.